Greetings, greetings, welcome to Bereka Mosadi, a show about profiling all the young women who have decided to take their respective industries by the reins. Today, we're looking at Malma Diva, who happens to be a co-founder at Yuffie Threads, an urban streetwear brand, as well as Wabwombu Naturals, a skin and hair care pro uh, product range. My name is Wendy Koza, and today we're at Tribeca at Brooklyn Mall. Let's see what she's up to. I'm excited. squeeze in here and just yeah. join the party. Hi. How are you guys doing? I'm good. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's Hi. good. Hi, Wendy. Hi, guys. So, Oma and Lava, like, who are you? Um, Kayumbo. Uh, Mel's partner in one of our businesses. Uh, mm -hmm. Which is the name of uh, Yapi Thread. So, uh, yeah. Okay, the urban, the urban. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> Alright, okay. And then what do you do? Um, photographer by day, uh, graphic designer. Uh, yeah, run a business. That's me in a nutshell. CV, 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 CV. <laughs> okay, and the beautiful lady this side? Uh, my name is Mashaka uh -huh. I'm a business coach. Okay. I was introduced to Mel just a couple of months ago. I'm coaching them in, their, in the business that he has partnered with Kayombe. Okay, so this is like tag team vibes, Jay. I know. <laughs> no matter what, we must just dream team. Okay, so okay, fine. Now, who? How do you know her? Like, besides yeah. introduction, okay, the so person she is. We have been introduced to her and her partner um, about two months ago, right? Yes. About two months ago, when they came in for incubation at our two projects. Okay. Because I'm a coach at our two project, they were assigned to me as business owners for me to coach them throughout their journey. Hey. Yes. Is cool. <laughs> She's pretty cool. <laughs> okay. And okay, so you guys met, did the whole, you know, mentoring thing and it's still well, it's work in progress. progress. Yes. Work in progress. It's a six month project at their it's a six month program at their working project. So what mm -hmm. we do is we identify entities or enterprises that are run by high growth entrepreneurs mm -hmm. and we identify those businesses that have a growth potential. So when she was incubated, they were interviewed and they uh, put through a lot of stringent process of determining if their business. <laughs> screening them. Yes, essentially. screening them. Heavy. If the business has a potential for growth and if there is a direct link or the correct matching between the business owners and the business itself. Okay. All right. So as an entrepreneur, let's say, what qualities do I have to possess to actually be successful? You know, the entrepreneurship area has evolved over time and this is um, due to the fact that um, um, our world is changing quite fast. And we have Globalization. Such as, precisely. We have enablers such as technology that is changing overnight all mm. the time. And you need to be agile as an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. And by agility, that means that with whatever you have today, mm -hmm. with as little as you have on your hand, you have to start. Yeah. But okay, so, and then co-founder. Co -founder. Uh, Tell us about how, you know, your relationship with Mal has no, been, uh, yes? Well, we basically went to school, we made at school. Uh -huh. She was studying graphic, I mean, interior design, I was studying graphic design. So, here and there we pass each other and I thought, okay, wow. There's, There's something, in, something common. in common Think that, that way we could do. And yeah. we kind of started listening to music together, we shared uh -huh. the music. And uh -huh. It became more than just sharing music, mm -hmm. it became a relationship in every aspect that yeah. we can think of. Like yeah. Creative, mm -hmm. photographic, emotional. What pleasure! <laughs> <laughs> and uh -huh. yeah, we've just grown from there. We've known each other for like three, three years. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so you met in tertiary? Yes. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Alright. How long we've known each other. So yeah. tell me about yourself, girl. We've been talking about you like you're not here. <laughs> She's right here. She's right here, ladies and gentlemen. Right She's right here. here. I'm right here. Well, I'm just, uh, I'm myself. I don't know how to be anybody else. Mm -hmm. So I, I, if I see something that I'm interested in, you're feisty. And I, <laughs> you're feisty. Apparently, I'm feisty. <laughs> but if I, if I like something and I believe in it, then I will definitely commit to, to, to the execution thereof. And if I can't, I will always be accountable, as much like I said. Um, if, if I can't do something anymore, then I won't do it. But I also, I, I like to finish what I start. Mm -hmm. yeah. Speaking of finishing what you start, 
you started two companies. How did that, how did you get there? How did you decide, wake up one day and be like, what, maybe? With, 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 I, I mean, I have so many ideas. You just wake up in the morning, you're like, oh, that would be cool if this mm -hmm. happens. But then, you know, you keep saying all these things to yourself and then nothing is happening. So actually, I was speaking to Kayombo. I don't know how many ideas I had. I had a, a totally <laughs> different mm -hmm. um, idea, you know, where I didn't think that I'd be where I am right now four years ago. Yeah. And I kept on telling him my ideas and he was just like, you know, you should do something about your ideas. So I was walking with him one day and we saw a couch in the middle of nowhere and then he was like, you know, it would be cool to take this couch and make it a new thing mm -hmm. and sell it, you okay. know, get money. You're sell basically it. taking something from nothing and making something out of it. We decided to, to, to merge our skills mm -hmm. and um, create Yappy Threads. And then the other business, uh, <laughs> the other business, <laughs> well, well, well no more like pieces. Um, actually, I was just, I just got a, a, a random WhatsApp text from, from this girl who got mm -hmm. my number from somewhere. I don't mm -hmm. know. And, other parts. Yes, and, then, and, and my, my experience in interior design, um, making presentations uh, for, 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 you know, houses and whatever. Yeah. That taught myself taught myself graphic design and yeah. I started venturing out into graphic design yeah. and so with the I, aid of, yeah, of with, course yeah yeah, yeah. And, and and then I, I did the the branding for one movie naturals and then we met a few times and then he said you know you're actually a great person and we want you on the team uh -huh. and it was very early stages of, of, of one movie naturals mm -hmm. and so we skyrocketed after branding and with my input and us working together as a team it's, it's really the best team I've ever worked with in my life that's great yeah. man that's interesting because I mean a lot of people try to go into these as young people mm. try to go out and see these businesses and you know it fails one friend leaves and it just flops yeah. it's good to see that you guys have that determination you know to actually keep it going yeah. hey guys it was really nice meeting you it was nice chatting Anyway, so that's it for Mel right now, but later on we're going to catch up with her without her, you know, <laughs> associates, entourage as they would say. And we'll catch up with her and get a little bit more nitty gritty on things. Well, for now, let me excuse myself.